I'm Nico Halili, and welcome to The Score, where we tackle the hottest and trending topics in sports. The last two semifinal spots in the UAP Men's Basketball Tournament is down to a three-team race. The Lasalle Green Archers, UP Fighting Maroons, and FU Tamaraos will fight for the third and fourth seeds in the Final Four. Now, Lasalle has the inside track on that number three spot, but things could get very complicated if they lose to UP in their final elimination round game. And if FU beats Adamson on Sunday, uh, which is really a no-bearing game for the Adamson Soaring Falcons, having clinched the number two seed in the semifinal round. Of course, the defending champion Blue Eagles will enter the Final Four as the number one seed. So let's discuss the uh, fun scenarios in the race to the Final Four with uh, our... Uh, Suki, Suki, uh, Suki analyst. Kami lang available. Hindi <laughs> ah, marami okay, okay. kayo available kaya lang kayo ang lagi yes. hinarap ng tao. Uh, Bo Belga, of course, and uh, Jai uh, Reyes. So, Bo and Jai, welcome back. Final four race. Tatlo na, tatlong teams yeah. ang gusto pang maka, uh, makapasok. Let's let's bring up the, t- the team standings again. Uh, Bo, kasi may crucial game sa Wednesday and sa Sunday. Mm. No? Doon sa tatlong team, Sino sa tingin mo yung parang medyo maganda ang uh, ang chance na makapasok sa Final Four? Ah, uh, ako I think yung ano, yung if UP beats um Lasal on Wednesday. On Wednesday. They 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 secure the three spot for sure. Kasi nakita ko yung mga scenario nung mga scenario, mga scenario last right, time. Right. How about you, Jai? Well, meron na talaga advantage yung Lasal being mas lamang sila sa sa wins. Sa wins. Pero the way UP is playing right now, the number of assists in their last couple of games, medyo nagkakaamuyan na yung players nila. And we all know that they're very, very talented. So it's going to be fun to watch for all of us. What will be fun to watch, uh, 100% sure, is that game on Wednesday. Mm-hmm. Uh, so on Wednesday, Ateneo will face UST in the first game. So Ateneo, no bearing mm-hmm. na yan. Um, uh, because even if Ateneo loses, uh, even if magtayang Adamson, Ateneo will win tiebreaker. So it's, it's the same. They'll be number one. That game at 4 o'clock on Wednesday, uh, LaSalle versus UP, okay? That is so crucial. Whoever wins that... Secure the number 3 spot. Will secure a spot. Yes. A spot. Will secure sure. a spot. Tapos, so UP's chances against LaSalle, ito na yung... Oh my gosh, I think baka 80% of the big dog, panay UP itong ano. Ang tingin ko lang, ah, on Wednesday. Because this is their biggest, biggest, chance. Chance, biggest chance. This is it. This is an opportunity they, they cannot yes. waste, Lose. Jai. Oh, yung UP, yun na nga, eh, pinag-usapan natin kanina, gutom na gutom na talaga yan, makapasok <laughs> sa Final Four. I'm sure the whole uh, student body susuporta so talaga sa game na yan. And... Yun na nga, we'll see what happens. Sigurado lang ako talaga bakbakan yung game na yan. Now, the other crucial game, and we showed that uh, a moment ago, that FU Adamson game. Tingin mo kasi, Bo, yung Adamson, kasi no bearing na si Adamson, twice to beat whatever mm-hmm. happens. Sa palagay mo, si Coach Francis is going to say, uh, hindi na tayo all out, uh, I will rest, Anmisi, Manganti, Papisar, all the crucial guys. So sa tingin mo, that's that that's uh, FU's game to win. Kumbaga, oh, oh, para ano I think I think kasi kung ako si, kung ako siyempre, siyempre iisipin mo rin yung kalagayan ng player mo ngayon. Mali, maliban na lang kung merong MVP content, contender. Ah, kung may hinahabol na stats oh, diba? or um, uh-huh. 'yun ang iisipin na lang ni Coach Franz. Pero kung ako sa position ni Coach Franz, pasok mo nang saglit, sub, pahinga na for the rest of the game kasi Number two spot naman na sila eh. Ano pa bang papatunayan mo, di ba? So, doon ka mag... Doon mo patunayan yung sarili mo pagdating doon sa playoffs na... Yeah. Ang masaya niyan, if UP uh, wins on Wednesday and then FU wins on Sunday, Jai, yeah. we're gonna have a three-way tie. <laughs> Oo oh, nga eh. So, you know, <laughs> exciting yung UAP ngayon. Uh, Dati, di ba? Sabi natin, ito, school na to finals na. Intay na lang ko sino oh, kalaban. Diba? Ngayon, it's very, very exciting. Now, yung matchup nung FU at tsaka, tsaka Adamson, for FEU para sa akin, if they lose that game, eh, talaga nga naman, hindi na sila deserving talagang pumasok uh, sa Final Four, di ba? Of course, may injuries sila. We all understand that. But for Adamson naman, uh, I don't think Coach France is really looking at yung mga individual, individual awards. Award. Pero at the same time, gusto mo papasok ka ng Final Four always. May yung galing ka sa panalo, eh, di ba? May momentum. Did you ever have any experience, Jai, in the UAP in, in, in your five years for Ateneo na 
no bearing on last game. Yes. Tapos, so what did you guys do? What did Nor- um, Coach Norman say? Okay, UST kalaban namin nun. Sure na kami ng, ng, ng top two seeds sa, sa Final Four. Natalo kami sa UST. They went in Final Four. Okay. Sila pa ang pumasok kalaban namin sa Finals. <laughs> Natalo. Oh, yun yun! Yung Kramer, JC and Tyler. Oh, yun yun. So, that's yun, 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 yun. So, ano lesson dun? Ang lesson dun is, oy, although that game, gusto namin manalo, pero we were also thinking to keep guys fresh. Okay. So, ang lesson dun, siguro, ipanalo na lang talaga yung, <laughs> yung, yung, yung games. Dahil, gusto mo talaga pumasok coming of a win talaga. Dahil magandang ano, confidence builder for the rest of the team. So, in other words, kung ikaw yung Adamson, <laughs> Baka itong FAU pang ma- oh, oh. makatapat mo. Yes. No, that's, uh, that's it. Pero ikaw talaga ba, naniniwala ka, if Coach Franz were to ask you, uh, pre, <laughs> ako ba ilalaro ko ba ito? Ipahinga ko na lang yung mga player ko. Hindi ako, ano lang ako, he was injury lang ang iniisip ko. Tama. Come Final Four. Kasi sa tingin ko, sa kumpiyansa-kumpiyansa, the way maglaro yung ahamisi, mga anti, Walang konsensya to mira eh. So, hindi at tingin ko hindi magkaka problema si Coach Fran sa sa kumpiyansa. Uh, in terms of the way they've been playing especially in the second round, who's really looking good? You know, as you know for a time nila sal puro panalo mm-hmm. but then you know they uh, they were uh, uh, dominated by the Blue Eagles uh, in their last game. If you know man kakabalik pa lang ni Prince Orizo yes. and Orizo I would imagine is still not 100% uh, game shape. Ito namang uh, UP you know, roller coaster season, <laughs> but uh, you, ano rin, uh, Paul Desiderio coming off a nice game, mm-hmm. Bright Akoweti always coming off uh, big game. So, sino yung pinakamaganda nilalaro entering itong last two game days ng UAP? Um, para sa akin right now, UP yung talagang may momentum sila going to the last couple of days of the UAP. And kasali na rin siguro dahil yun na, may sense of urgency na. Kailangan na nilang pumasok Siguro na lalabas na nila yung talents nila ngayon and I'd like to see them talaga na go all the way sa final four na maganda yung laro. How about you, Bo? Ako din. UP from the din. start, from the start of the season, I'm looking forward sa UP talaga. Na mag-final. Na mag-final four. Wow. Hey, tingin mo. Sa sobrang uh, <laughs> sobrang uh, emotional ng uh, UP uh, fandom pati si Jai tsaka oh, si Extra Rice. Ito yun dyan yung bata. <laughs> Tangin, yun, eh. Mr. Atin to. Ah, Ponte Sidero. Ponte Sidero. Pinag-champion kami niyan sa ano, oh, PJD League. Ayan, so kasama na to sa ano, fighting marag sa cheering, uh, <laughs> cheering squad. Bo and uh, Jai. Again, the crucial game. So Wednesday, UP versus Lasal. And then Sunday, Adamson versus FU. Okay.